sorry. This is part three. I know what I'm doing wrong. When I moved the camera, I touched the, the screen and it, uh, it like shut down my camera. So sorry. I debate whether I should even post these, but I might just do it anyway. Maybe you don't have time to watch all three right now. Maybe you just have time for one of three, and then later you'll watch two and then three. It's up to you. Four more minutes. This is really old water soluble stabilizer. That could be 15 years old as well. probably change my needle after this because I've done two t-shirts. I can't remember. I think I changed it after I did the eagle scene, which I posted two videos. Should I share about that? The eagle design on a men's lightweight sweatshirt. And it's good to change your needle now and then. You see I change it after every project I think I read. But, like these, I don't know, I, I can kind of tell as I watch it so. I mean, if it's 50,000 stitches, definitely I would change it. I'll probably change it after I do this one. So I will just review since we're stand I'm standing here just watching. This design was from embroiderydownload.com and it's this one is oh check and rethread upper thread. Okay, we're not gonna have perfect luck with this one, but this is good because I can show you it just looks like the thread broke. I can show you how easy it is to fix it, but I'm probably going to have to back up. Figure out where I need to back up to. At least, okay, so let me go back. So there's a certain feature on my machine. Yeah, I can tell. It looks like it broke right about there. See how it's, it was starting to sew here. So if I start here, I'm just going to do like a lock stitch here. And then I'll start it up again. Hopefully it won't break again. There we go. I don't off. I don't have thread break like that too often. It looks like it's doing okay now. This is really cool. This machine has an app um, monitoring app, baby lock monitoring, IQ monitoring, I think it's called. And if I'm stitching out something that's gonna take a while. I can turn that on my phone and I can watch from another room and watch it stitch out make sure, you know, you always should be making sure there's, no, there's nothing in the way and never leave it. If you think there's a chance something could flop in the, the main sewing area. But um, like the other night when I was doing the eagle, there was a part of the pattern that was going to take a long time, and it was already very late. So I turned that on, and it was watched it from my bed, and um, it was a good thing I did that because I got a rest. But then I also saw that a thread broke. Came in here, changed it, got it going again, 
and uh, it stitched out the rest, no problem. Almost done. One minute. I just needs to go across to the top there. Up here. Yeah, it's going across the, the front of the headband or whatever that is. And then I'm, I would guess, yeah, across the top of the head and yeah, any other uh, small outlines on the top that it needs to do. I think it's fine. It's a pretty gentle stabilizer. So I was telling you this is from uh, embroiderydownload.com. It's a green ninja lego ninjago design so that's it you know there's nothing more to it it's done and so i just opened up the hoop area and now you can see with your own eyes there's a couple threads in there I think I need to trim, but I'll take it out and then I'll rip this stuff off and cut around the back. But that's it. Thank you for joining me. I hope you enjoy, enjoyed it. Thank you.